Please take note of the Watchtower's favorable reference to William Tyndale, who was an English scholar and a leading figure in the Protestant Reformation, best known for his translation of the Bible into English. This is from the Watchtower of September 15, 1997. Quote, Working from the original Greek of Erasmus text rather than the Latin, Tyndale chose love over charity to express the meaning of the Greek term agape more fully. He also used congregation in place of church, repent instead of have penance, and, get this, elders rather than priestess. These adjustments were devastating to the authority of the church and to traditional religious practices such as confession to priests. Unquote. Take note of three things. One, these are things the watchtower itself rejects. Two, note the change from priests to elders. That is profound. Three, confession to priests is among the list of things the watchtower apparently finds agreement with Tyndale on. Or do they? Why does the watchtower so strongly emphasize confession of sins to elders? As a father, I never expected this to happen to my family. One day, my son came home from work and told me that he had committed a sin. I asked him if it was serious, and he said that it was. When my son confessed, I felt incredibly sad. This deep pain, because I really wasn't expecting this from him. I was very aware that the greatest love we should have should be for Jehovah. And that gave me the strength to encourage him to seek spiritual assistance. I said that the wise thing for him to do would be to seek Jehovah's help through the elders, to talk to them about it. The hypocrisy is astounding. This is an excessively dangerous practice from an organization that teaches that Jesus is not your mediator. Jesus Christ is not the mediator between Jehovah God and all mankind. He is the mediator between His Heavenly Father, Jehovah God, and the nation of spiritual Israel, which is limited to only 144,000 members. The Bible tells us that if we sin, we have an advocate with the Father. That advocate is our mediator, Jesus Christ. No one should be confessing their sins to elders. Confess your sins directly to God. He asked you to come to Him. Approach your God in confidence. He said, Come, let us reason together. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. Jehovah's Witnesses need to learn to trust God enough and to confess their sins to Him and stop confessing to, I was about to say priests, to elders who have too much control over the lives of Jehovah's Witnesses. It is wrong. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel, give a like, share, and please also share your thoughts in the comment section. I love hearing from you. What are your thoughts? All of these help to keep the videos coming. Before you go, please watch this short promo. The Jehovah's Witness organization will be protested appropriately during National Suicide Prevention Month on September 13th, 2024, at the White House. Please join the protest or help promote it. Log on to the website BeFreeProtest.com. That's BeFreeProtest.com. Our goal is to get Watchtower and other cults like them defunded. Absolutely no one should be shunned for no longer believing in their former religion. This is coercion and a violation of human rights. Join us in raising awareness about this vital protest by sharing it across all your social media platforms. Let your friends, family, and followers know about the harmful actions of the Watchtower and the need to put a stop to their abusive behavior. By sharing the message, you can help bring greater attention to this issue 
and empower those who have suffered at the hands of this organization. Together, we can stand up for justice and hold Watchtower accountable for their actions. Don't hesitate to share this message and invite others to join on the day of the protest. Log on today to be freeprotest.com to learn more and to indicate your intention to attend. May the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Mm-hmm.